Hello everybody, this is George Ponder for WPCentral.com. Got a video review for you. This go around, we're taking a look at the Windows Phone app, Gleek. Now, Gleek is a Twitter client app for your Windows Phone. It is, it, it, it's feature rich. I mean, there's a, that's the easiest way to describe it. It has a bit of flair, but it throws just about everything you can imagine that you need for Twitter on your Windows Phone. Main pages are laid out. I've got 69 new tweets. You've got a start page that has various tiles where you can uh, search to, uh, for people, start a new tweet. You've got messages, your favorites, trends and lists, your gleeks. Now, I will cover gleeks, what gleeks and peaks are here in a second, and then your account stats. Now, I'm not a real big Twitter buff. I, I consider myself a Twitter novice. Gleek does throw a lot at you. It's a little overwhelming, but eh, you get the hang of it fairly quick. Now, down below, you've got a couple of button controls and then your uh, three-dot menu. You've got a button control to add, start a new tweet, refresh the screen, and hit your search. One nice thing about Gleek, it does support multiple accounts. So if, say, you and your wife share this phone, you can have your account and her account on the same app. And all you got to do, you've got a little button here that would light up if I had multiple accounts, and you could switch back and forth. You've got settings, and there are a ton of settings. You've got your accounts, and this is where you'd add that second, third, or fourth, whatever account. Overall preferences, you've got layout preferences. You do have live tiles that basically you can pin just about everything that Gleek offers to your start screen. We'll get into more details about the, the settings here in the post. You got uh, how you want your tweets to look and then a couple of extras. Another nice thing about Gleek is manage mutes. If you don't want to hear from somebody without unfriending them, you can mute them. And Gleek has that ability. Not only can you mute, mute them permanently, but you also have a timed mute where if they get in this tirade and you just really don't want to hear it, don't want to see those tweets, just time that mute for a couple of hours and it takes care of that. All right, swiping over, you've got peaks. Now, peaks, what it is, it's, it's random tweets from other Twitter users worldwide. You may see something you like, and if you do, you can gleek the peak. Gleeks are basically retweets of peaks. It, it took me a while to figure that one out, but that's basically what it is. Down below on the peaks page, you've got options to tag a, a, a peak as a favorite. You can re reply to the peak. You can also retweet the peak as well as gleek the peak. Now moving on from the peaks, you've got the timeline. This is your traditional view. For your Twitter, you've got any mentions, retweets, trust me they're there, and then you're, you go back to your start. Again, the Gleeks, that tile is going to pull up all the Gleeks that have, are all the peaks that have been Gleeked to give you an idea of what everyone else is retweeting from the peaks. It'll show your Gleeks as well. Now, all in all, Gleek, again, is a feature-rich Twitter client. It has a bit of a flair, and then you've got that uh, twist with the Gleeks and Peaks. It's a nice Twitter app. If you're looking for a feature-rich, a nice-looking Twitter app for your Windows phone, it might be worth giving Gleek a try. There is a free trial version available, so you can try it before you buy it. The full version will run you $1.99, and it's all available over at the Windows Phone Marketplace. And as always, we'll have the Marketplace links in the post.